Live from Acadia, your local news leader, this is KLFY News 10 Morning Rush. The time is now 6.56. Let's get you caught up on today's top stories as you head out the door with the News 10 Morning Rush. Good morning, Acadiana. I'm News 10's Danielle Johnson. Right now, Lafayette police are investigating an overnight shooting from Sunday in downtown Lafayette that injured two people. This is just one week after 12 people were injured in a downtown Lafayette shooting. This is an active investigation. Anyone with details is asked to call the Lafayette Police Department. The body of a 37-year-old man was found face down in a ditch with water. The cause of death is unknown at this time. Authorities are still investigating. Investigators in the Bahamas are searching for clues to explain the mysterious death of three American tourists staying in two separate villas at a sandals resort. Authorities say they do not suspect foul play and do not believe any hotel guests are in danger. Funeral services for East Baton Rouge Parish Deputy Nick Toulier will take place Tuesday. Toulier died last week after being injured in an ambush six years ago. Good morning, Acadiana. I'm News 10 Rodrika Taylor in Lafayette on Johnson Street and University. Abortion rights supporters held a rally to express their concerns on Roe versus Wade being overturned by the Supreme Court. Abortion rights activists held protest over a leaked draft majority opinion, indicating the Supreme Court may be poised to overturn Roe v. Wade. The Acadiana Music Spotlight featuring Ruben Moreno on Camelfly News 10 this morning. Ruben putting on a show for us, four interviews and four songs. Don't forget Acadiana, you can watch the full edition on Camelfly.com. It's going to be a hot one here on this Monday. It's already very warm outside with some patchy fog, but summer-like there. Look at the high, 91, feeling like the mid to upper 90s under partly cloudy skies. You keep the rain gear at home. We're not expecting any showers or storms. All right, well, it was a beautiful weekend in Brobridge for the Crawfish Festival. I know we're keeping our fingers crossed for rain this weekend. I know. I hope they have good weather for that this weekend. And it was a beautiful weekend overall. I mean, it was hot yesterday, but got to enjoy time with family and uh, in Homa and down the bayou. You got to stick around here. Yes. I know your mom's busy too, so, but I know everybody enjoyed it with the weather. Definitely. Here. Yeah, my mom's a florist, so it was her Super Bowl Sunday yesterday for Mother's Day. They were so busy, they literally took the phone off the hook at one point. Oh. So, yeah, shout out to all those moms that yeah. were working and hustling on Mother's Day. We love you guys. Thank you so much for joining us on Pospot 2 this morning. Yep, we'll be back here at noon. We hope you have a great morning. And thank you for starting your week off with us here. Enjoy the weather and stay warm, or I should say, stay cool. <laughs> Put your sunscreen on and have a great day. We'll see you at noon.